Hello YouTube, Sacred Fox here. Welcome to the second of my Amstrad PCW tutorial videos. This time we're going to be looking at a Mallard Basic. So you've just seen me load up the CPM operating system. Simply type Basic and return. And you can type in any basic programs such as you normally type in on a BBC Micro or whatever. So you type in your line 1 line to it's just type some gibberish which is to be fair what most basic programs look like <coughs> right so say you had a error on the second line there's no way to go back to it unless you do edit type in your line number take out what was wrong if you type list you can list that relist the whole program you typed in you can see it's uh, it's amended it slightly there, amended the second line, and also missed out a character on the third line, which is a bit odd. Oh well. So, and if you wanted to save it, you would just type save and call it whatever you wanted. Let's call it program, and you just press return, and then that would save it to a save it to a formatted disk. And then you could reload the program any time without having to type it all in again. Very useful for big long programs. So, I'll show you a game I've typed in previously. It's quite a long program, so I've saved this to disk. It's called Duck Shoot. Let's just get rid of that. So let's run Duck. There we go. Press space by to fire your little bullets. You've got 20 of them. I used to play this game loads as a kid. It came on a compilation disc called It's Basic, full of basic games. But this one I found separately listed in an old Amstrad magazine. I found the basic code, so I've input this one in by hand. So if anyone wants to know the code, uh, let me know. I would put it in the description below, but I've got a feeling YouTube would probably corrupt all the spacings, which is pretty important when writing in BASIC. So, as you can see, I'm not very good at it. I never really was. Hey, I'm getting better. Eight birds sharp. So after that, it just breaks, and then you just have to like run duck again. So let's just see if we can list the program and show you what I've typed in previously. There we go. That was the whole program. It doesn't look very long, but it's like quite uh, time-consuming to make sure you've got all the spaces, especially when you're typing in from an old magazine where their font is different to the Amstrad font on the screen, like very very difficult but yeah there it is so don't have to retype that in I've saved it to disk so yeah you can do that yourself with any programs so I hope this has been of some use to anyone with the Amstrad PCW wanting to delve into basics slightly thanks for watching